Now, 800 CHAB presents Ask the Expert. Here's Rob Carney. You know, I think one of the best ways to protect your classic car or truck is to rent a crane and put it up on the roof of your business. That's what Greg Marcinek does here at Heritage Insurance in downtown Moose Jaw. Uh, and that's that that's the one with the red truck on the on the roof. Uh, but it's it's that time of season, Greg. Antique and classic cars are starting to hit the road again. Of course, we put them away in the winter to save them from the salt and the snow and collisions. But now the folks are bringing them out, and uh, there's some some things they got to keep in mind when it comes to insurance relating to their uh, classic cars. And trucks. That's correct, Rob. Uh, you know, when you're insuring a class car, uh, you must consider how you're going to be using that vehicle. And the first thing would be, uh, are you only going to be using it to drive to the car shows or are you towing it there or are you going into a few parades? So you want to make sure you have that type of policy and you're not paying too much. The other thing is if you're using your vehicle on a regular basis, going to pick up groceries or just cruise it on a Sunday afternoon, again, the policy is going to reflect on the type of use that you're using. A uh, typical classic car insurance policy uh, will include an agreed value coverage which pays for the car's full insured value with no depreciation in the event of a total loss, of course last year deductible. And also uh, some of the policies do have inflation guards so that will compensate on uh, inflation appreciation and uh, the policy increases the vehicle's value yearly. So there's also uh, spare parts coverage in the event that something does happen. There's some additional coverage options. Uh, we've actually got a brand new company that we picked up here that will provide emergency towing in the case of breakdown, roadside assistance, uh, emergency loss out emergency travel expenses in case your vehicle breaks down while you're away from home uh, there's a theft reward there's also car show expense uh, that will pay for expenses associated with missing a car due to a breakdown and uh, personal effects uh, the policy will reimburse you for items that are vandalized or stolen when reported to the police now, uh, these policies come at all different price levels, I'm assuming? Well, that's correct. Uh, the more coverage you get, the more expensive it is. Mm -hmm. But the biggest thing is that you come in, sit down, talk to one of our qualified brokers here, and uh, get what you want. Uh, again, uh, you can have bare bones coverage or you can have coverage because I know a lot of these guys, they put a lot of time and effort and it's their baby and they do want to take care of it as such. As I mentioned, your baby's on the roof. What? Tell us about that truck. Uh, well, it's a 1936 Chev Maple Leaf, and it was actually manufactured in Regina. So it's uh, it's it's built here in Saskatchewan, uh, part of the home. And do you bring it off the roof every now and then? I uh, haven't for a few years, but uh, we're talking about it because it can be drivable. <laughs> and I'm guessing it's fully insured? It is fully insured. Way to go. <laughs> Greg Marson at Heritage Insurance. If you have any questions at all about antique and classic car insurance, just drop in down here. Heritage Insurance, downtown Moose Jaw, corner of First Northwest and Fairford. This has been Ask the Expert on 800 CHAB.